Mm -hmm. Done. Now go. All right. So now we've finished the uh, texture part of the mask, and we'll move on to painting after it dries. All right. So have it very watery, and get in. You're gonna want to get in all the little crevices, which could take a while, but it's worth it for the detail. Um. So you can go around. I forgot to mention that uh, the particular one we're using right now is Craft Smart Gold. Um, it, it is metallic, but if you put it on thin enough and light enough, it shouldn't be. So that's kind of your reference point. It should be on so it's not shiny. See, like, get, get in here. And that's basically it, so. Okay, so now we did the base color. Um, just kind of blotched it on, but fairly evenly. We're gonna work on dark brown, the dark brown blotches, and right now we're using Craft Smart, just regular brown. And it's fine if it mixes with the other stuff on the, on the plate, because you want it to be kind of vague. Um, so now, do the same thing with the lots of water. And blotch it wherever you want it. I just go very light, um, because you can always make it darker. That's a little too light. Can you see? Well, yeah, I got it. Okay. I'm and master cameraman, remember? Yes. Kidding. <laughs> and still make sure to get in all the little crevices. It just... I'm, I'm a huge perfectionist, but um, it's it still just looks better if it's very detailed. Alright, so now you see we've done the darker brown part. So you can, do, you can do a little more or a little less than we did. It all just depends on how you want it. Now we're going to move on to the red. And we have two shades. We have Rookwood Red, which is, um, there's, and we have Brick Red. You can see there's a very slight difference. Um, personally, I there's like this. There's a whole shade difference. Yes. Printer's daughter here, sorry. But slight, so. So, personally, I like Brick Red better. It has more brown in it, basically. Uh, so. And, that was a bit much. But, you want to do less red than any other color. Just, it, it's very strong, it pops. So, same deal with the water. And let's put a little spot here. Turn it towards me more. Might want to even mix in a little brown. Yeah. Sorry, I was just wanting to see. Again, make sure I'm using a smaller brush here for just the little nooks and crannies. Quit playing with my wrist brace. And the recording? Um, no, no, hang on. And I don't know, you might want to make the patches quite vague unless you want polka dots, which would be kind of awesome, but not what we were planning. So make them kind of fade out a bit. And there you go. All right, so as you can see, we've added the red, and we haven't really done the back yet, but this is what, it's, this is what it should look like. So now all you have to do is put the, uh, put the nurse cap on, which you just, you just do as part of the cosplay, and then you're good.